Sean Pereira from the Great Maryland Business Chamber here with Bruce Christensen and Steve Moore from Club Angle at their latest facility, which is in construction, as you can see. Bruce, pleasure as always. Thanks, Sean. Looking Thanks for being here, mate. Thanks, Sean. Excellent. What are, we, uh, what are we seeing today, Bruce? Uh, well, we're going to see, uh, I suppose, about three quarters uh, construction. Right. So uh, happy to take you through and uh, we, we can see how, how it compares now to the mock-ups that we uh, have already seen. Fantastic, guys. Pretty excited about this. Let's take a look through, guys. This is, our, this is our main foyer. Uh, so when, when you come into this area here, you'll have the reception area here to your side, so you'll get greeted here. And as I was just saying, you, you've got your sports bar through here to the left. Then in front of us here, we have the main, the main bar. So basically you'll be walking straight out the bar. It's a spectacular looking bar. Takes, takes the whole sort of length of here. Um, then as you walk, way, walk through here, one of the other issues that um, the building had previously was you had to walk right through the main part of this lounge area to get from one end to the other. So what we've created here is this is this walkway through where you've got the lounge areas on either side of you, but if you're going through to the function rooms, which are at the far end of the club, then you can basically just walk straight down this passageway uh, without actually walking through uh, people that are watching TV or having a meal or sitting down having a cup of coffee or whatever. So, so again, it's, it's about trying to sort of make sure people's spaces uh, are giving them what they want and, yeah. and not, not sort of having people walking through the middle of what they're, what they're sort of trying to Absolutely. do. We've still got the fireplace here. So this is in the formal, the formal dining area. This was always a really popular, a popular sort of area, particularly in winter, uh, this lounge area with that fireplace going. And so we, we've maintained the fireplace. As we walk through to here, and as you can see, this is a fairly, this is a fairly large function space. So as I, um, it's, it's aimed to do 200 sit down for a wedding environment. So dance floor, bridal party, uh, and, and 200 guests uh, is, is what it's been designed to do. And over here's the bar, uh, the bar area. So as I say, once again, uh, a good size space because you, you need to make sure you can, you can uh, look after the number of people that you've got in here. Um, these, high, these high ceilings will just be, be amazing. Uh, the, once again, the artist impressions of those are, are just fantastic. This area will have lawn, lawn down here. So this would be absolutely perfect for pre-dinner pre drinks up yes. here, uh, whether it be a wedding or whether it be any other type of, type of function. Uh, you've got the old, the old circle area there being reworked now. Uh, a great area for um, for the actual uh, ceremony in a, in a wedding situation. Uh, the ceremony can take place down there. Photos can be done. The guests can make their way back up and start having some pre-dinner drinks. It all integrates so nicely together. And as I say, it's very much being geared around uh, a wedding environment, but could be the same for any, any function, whether that's a birthday party or whether it's a corporate event. So that's pretty much where it's at. It's got a little bit of work to go. Uh, Bruce and Steve, it was a real pleasure coming out here today and it's good to see your plans coming to fruition here. Um, as I say, I mean, you've been a big part of Chamber for a long time and we look forward to working with you going forward. And I'm pretty excited uh, to actually attend the venue here and bring the family along to the local guys out there. Uh, Bruce says it best, Club and Angle. It's where MacArthur meets. Thanks, guys.